What's going on guys? It's Sep and today we are going to be going over the Uzume RR4. This is the best sniper in the game. No ifs ands buts about it. It has a 50 zoom which is the best zoom in the game because it has an incredibly consistent hitbox. Uh, the only sniper rifle that comes with perks as good as the Uzume is the Eye of Soul Adept and that is due to the fact that it can roll with snap and Vorpal on the Uzume. It is it is the bread and butter, it is the best thing, and the reason that it outpaces the Eye of Soul is due to the fact that it has a 50 instead of a 45 zoom. It's gonna give it that bigger hitbox, it's gonna be a lot more consistent, and it is crazy nice when you're playing on gigantic maps like, you know, let's say Widow's Court, which we had all weekend. Due to the fact there's a fog, it helps you cut right through that as it highlights your targets, just a little added bonus. Remember, if you do get the adept roll, even if your MNK adept targeting is going to help you, it is a super, super nice thing to go for, but it is dropping this week. So if you guys want your own Uzume, which like I said, it's literally statistically the best sniper. The only sniper with a more consistent hitbox is the occluded finality. And that gun has a telescope on it. It is a 58 zoom. You do not want to be using that. It is fun. It is incredible to use, but it is not going to be nearly as competitive as something like the Uzume. Now, the reason that I have explosive payload on it is because I am unlucky. But, you know, it's also really nice because if someone goes around a corner, the explosive payload hits for 60 damage. It is actually insane, even if you miss a target. But uh, yeah, this is definitely one of the smoothest snipers in the game that you can get. We're going to also be running sniper targeting as well. And we do have a sniper scav on normally. I forget to add that. And uh, we are going to be pairing it with the Ace of Spades today. And we're going to be, you know, throwing a couple of smoke bombs, trying to keep ourselves alive. Uh, I am using Dragon Shadow instead of Stompies, as when you're using uh, Stompies, you know, you're moving a little bit faster. It's going to make it a little harder to snipe. So I like to slow it down a bit, go with the extra handling. It's going to be super nice. But yeah, let's go ahead and hop into a game and I'll uh, show you guys exactly what it does. All right, looks like we got a game of Rusted Lance. Not too bad, not too bad, not too bad. Hopefully we uh, don't have... I just got done with the game of Endless Veil. And I, it, although it went well, I have never had so many people spawn around me at the exact same time. Okay, this is a disaster. Let's uh, get out of that. Sir, I don't know if you realize this, but you are way, 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 way too high in the sky. I can't look up that high. Oh no, I gotta sneeze. <coughs> <coughs> uh, how do you record YouTube videos with allergies? Somebody, please, tell me. Tell me what the secret is. There's somebody over there. Well, this is interesting, isn't it? Lining up shoulder peaks is always super nice. Especially when you have a giant hitbox. What? He's just walking at me with a Lord of Wolves! What a maniac! What a maniac! Lord of Wolves is too much range to at me. And they're in the, all the shotguns range in the entire game and then leaving Lord of Wolves how it is. I'm going to fight you over it, aren't I? I'm going for it. That is my heavy. There's someone behind me. Get out of here. Let's take care of that gent. No, not the Lord of Wolves. I'm actually running away from him. He's a maniac. God dang it, dude. What do you do? I was too close, so I had to run away from Lord of Wolves because they literally can't hold a corner against that gun. Like, if it was any other shotgun, I'm fine. What a silly gun. What a silly, silly gun. Okay, let's let's get out in the open again. Let's not, uh, let's not be here fighting. What? Stealthiest man alive. Wow, that was cool.
How nice of them. To not be douches. Oh my goodness! Wild child? Golden Gun really is just lovely, you know? Now if we play a water tank, we'll be able to see radar behind us and fight the guys in front of us. I mean, you know, I missed. It happens. Please? Boys. There we go. Are you flying over again? I'm ready this time. You're not. They're, now they're all around me? All that time. All that time lining that shot up. I should be ashamed. It is true, I'm not Myron. Which goes to show how good the sniper actually is. Holy... How have I found myself here? Oh, oh goodness. He had a headshot. Surely he doesn't. No, okay. Is Titan pre-firing the corner? Dude, this guy's actually wild. See, we completely missed. We still did damage due to the explosive rounds. What's up? How did you miss such an easy shot? Well, you know. Oh, you know. That was odd. That was very odd. Oh, hey, thanks. Thanks for being AFK for the last kill. I appreciate you. Did I even miss those shots? I don't know. Regardless, did we die twice or three times in the last one counted? I always wonder if deaths after the game count. <coughs> Uzume truly is just a absolutely disgusting sniper. Statistically, it is literally the best sniper. It can roll a snap Vorpal, which is exactly what you want. I recommend that you either get accurized or steady rounds. Stability is nice because it helps out with the flinch. So getting a little extra stability is always super nice. You don't want necessarily as much range as possible. And the fact that you can get adept targeting makes it just that much more insane. It is a 50 zoom, so it competes with the Frozen Orbit and the Shepherd's Watch. So make sure that you guys pick this one up because it is literally the best sniper in the game. Even if you can only get a regular one, it is just as good. You're just missing out on a little bit of the hitbox. But Snap and Vorpal are the ones that you need to go for. If you get Snap Explosive, try it out. Let me know if you like, guys like it because it is entertaining to say the least. If you guys liked the video, let me know, and I appreciate you, and have an absolutely wonderful rest of your day. Later.